Hi, I'm Amy. Here's today's Top Whispers to Watch. Starting off with the much talked about Thibaut Courtois, the current Chelsea number one has been linked with a move to Real Madrid. <laughs> The teams that have hit the woodwork the most this season are Arsenal, West Ham and Everton. What do you make of that? I, need I think half it's of our disgusting Facebook. people's attitudes towards women watching oh. football. What? Firstly, Jose Mourinho has said what a disaster it is living in Manchester. He must be missing home after being spiked 4-0 by Chelsea at the weekend. I might have been slightly overdressed. <laughs> and now I feel desperately, desperately undressed. We for the occasion. Antonio Conte will become the fifth Italian Premier League manager of Chelsea, following in the footsteps of Viale, Renieri, Ancelotti and Di Matteo. Hey. I think we should get some ladies on the panel. Yeah. Yeah. Well, get I've some got... Arsenal ladies in. One, one's enough. Although beating Chelsea yesterday, Swansea have only kept one clean sheet in their last 17 away games. What do you make of that, Gordon? I'm now joined with Mark North, the creator of United London FC. Now, where did you first come up with the idea of obviously not having a manager? Uh, strangely enough, it was sat on the sofa with my wife watching X Factor and thought, well, why is there no voting shows for men? Um, obviously, being a big football fan and playing the likes of Football Manager. It just started to dominate my life. It wasn't long before my girlfriend left me. Hello and welcome back to 90 MFS. And in at number 10, it's Jose Mourinho's best mate, Juan Sheet Matter with 19 million. And creeping in at number 9, it's his old teammate from Chelsea, Eden Hazard with 20 million. In at number 8, it's Manchester United outcast Schweinsteiger with 20.1 million followers. He's there with the scarf on, the bobble out, the full works, I'll go like that. I love it. How do you see it all planning out then? Once you've picked your team, what are the next stages and how are the public going to get involved? Uh, no, don't worry about that. Two cheapest things on the menu, bottle of the house red and uh, no starters. Thanks very much. So. New chant for us. I'm in oh. love with Angolo. <laughs> do you like that? I haven't heard that. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? You know, yeah. you know I'm in love with the Coco. Yeah. I'm in love with Angolo. Who's the player? Kante. Ah, she actually lost her job after four days. Why was that? I can't remember the full story, but she Must didn't. have been a sexist reason. It's in... Oh. Have you scored yet? Okay. No. I'm not even going to attack you. Oh, oh yeah. And I've never played. No. <laughs> Amazing. I mean, it's Plymouth Our Girl even got seats. Like, they just stand right <laughs> They're green, they're green, well, yeah. last time I had, they had no money. What colour hair do you have? <laughs> We're talking about women that are interested in football. I think Who is the youngest Premier League player? <gasps> Might not necessarily be now. No, 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 no ever. Is the, yeah. Young player. Ryan Rooney? No. <laughs> Fulham, I'll give you a clue. Fulham. Fulham? Fulham. It's got Going back to 2007. Oh, man. You don't really look like a picture, do you? Oh, that was taken last year. I was in much better shape then. You've got five minutes to get your answers in. You're not going to even ask me any questions. Sorry, I'm just not used to making any effort. But, um, have some money. No! Meanwhile, Griezmann's sibling Theo has been having great fun on Twitter, teasing the United fans by posting a picture of Old Trafford. That's it for today. See you next time.